Tennessee Lady Volunteers lost their first SEC game, losing by 16 points to Vanderbilt on Sunday. Vanderbilt breaks a 16-game losing streak against Tennessee, and this is their seventh win all-time against the Lady Vols. The first half started as a tight defensive game, with turnovers on both sides. Lacey Brewer helped Tennessee take a six-point lead with nine minutes left with her six first half points. Vanderbilt responded with an 8-0 run to take the lead with seven to play, yet they wouldn't lead for long. Alex Fuller hit two shots in a row to get the lead back to Tennessee with five minutes to play, but then Vanderbilt had one more run. Hannah Tuomi scored 10 points in the first half, and she helped Vanderbilt to go on a 12-0 run in the final two minutes to lead by eight at halftime. Vanderbilt started the second half on a roll, eventually taking an 11-point lead in the first four minutes. The Commodores continued playing well in the second half, and on a Christina Worth three-pointer, Vanderbilt led by 13 with eight minutes to play. Vanderbilt kept pounding away and grew the lead to 21 with three minutes to play, putting the game out of reach. Five Commodores scored in double figures as Vanderbilt won with the final score, Vanderbilt 74, Tennessee 58. This is the first loss for the Lady Vols Memorial Gymnasium since 2002, and this is Tennessee's first conference loss for 2009. Kelly Kane had a solid second half for Tennessee. She scored 12 points and was Tennessee's lone scorer in double figures. The Lady Vols will be back on the road Thursday, facing Mississippi State in Starkville. The 8 p.m. tip-off between the Lady Vols and Bulldogs will be televised by CSS. For UTLadyVols.com, I'm Roger Hoover.